Hey gang, Scott here. Really quick tip for you in Lightroom for dodging and burning to target your dodge and burn to very specific tonal regions, but to do it in kind of an easy way. It's the combination of a luminance range mask and a brush. This intersect feature we have in Lightroom masking makes this very easy. I'll show you here on some whitewash. I want to start to brighten up, but this really works for anything that you're doing dodging and conversely burning. So let's do a luminance range and I'm interested in some of this whitewash down here. So I'll just do a little box on that and I get this range of stuff. Now I don't want this uh, to be everywhere. I, I only want it to be where I paint and that's the part that's cool. We go in here and we hit that triple dot and say intersect with a brush. And so now with my brush, wherever I brush, let's say I wanted my, my white wash. Let's get my feather a little bit bigger, like right through here. Just paint through. Notice I'm just getting what matches my luminance range. And then I can do a little exposure adjustment, push it really far so you can see it pop up there. But you know, a little bit. And maybe I'll leave my exposure staged so then I can start to visually work here and see where I want to have that little increase in my, uh, my dodging here in this case. Same concept works with burning. Lay down a luminance range mask first, intersect it with a brush, and then start painting through with whatever your increased or decreased exposure is to get that dodge and burn effect. It, it's really, it's really simple trick, and uh, I like it because you can just work visually and not be, uh, you know, trying to be painstakingly with your brush trying to get exactly where you need to go. You cap it with that luminance range mask. Hope you found the tip useful. Got questions? Go ahead and drop them below. And until next time, my name's Scott Davenport. Have fun.